So how to use it? Simply invoke it. So if we want to invoke the regular test, we are doing again PM test. And this will invoke V test. We saw in the previous chapter that it went clean. All the tests are okay. And now he's looking on all the files with dot test dot. And we see that everything is passing. Okay, so if we now want to invoke the coverage test, we simply need to do following npm run coverage. This will invoke the unit test, but it will compute also the coverage of the unit test, meaning how many lines of code are executed during the test relative to all of the code. Okay, so here we have only one file and we have 100% code coverage. So all function and all lines are covered, but suppose that I will remove a test. Suppose I will remove the test for clear. Okay. Suppose mm, not clear. Maybe maybe I will remove this. Okay. Now You will see that I'm not covering all the tests. I'm not covering all the lines. And in particular, the line number 40 is not covered. So I will go here. To line 40. And in line 40, we have the clear. Okay, so the code of the clear is not executed. And the code coverage has found it found the, the, the line and this is how we can also reveal code of land that are not tested. So now I will bring it back and invoke it again and I will, I will have 100% code coverage and because I'm testing only this file, I'm getting 100% for line and function. 